She adds Mo to everything she does, from her bodybuilding success to inspiring others to be their personal best. Meet Mona Lisa Reyes. The sport that I actually competed in is figure, which is a component of women's bodybuilding, um, but just a little bit more feminine. I competed for about five years. Um, I initially started with just the intention to inspire and motivate, and I really just wanted to be a role model. Tell me about what you guys wear. I know it gets kind of fancy. Right, right. Believe it or not, even though there's like very little clothing, um, it those suits cost anywhere from $750 to $1,000. But we do uh, paint ourselves. So you see some of the pictures where we're super Super dark, um, like probably ten shades of brown, um, and you know we do that more for the fact that we're on stage and the lights are so bright, so it tends to drain some of your definition. When competing, you know you get the oohs and the ahs, the kudos, the photo shoots, the trophies, the recognition, the titles. But at the end of the day, it's not even just about that. It's about how you make an impact in other people's lives. I actually generated a bit of a fan base and from that spawned Go Team Mo. And so when I was finally ready to close that chapter after five years of competing and 23 competitions later, I says I want to take that same passion and energy and truly give myself to other people, whether it's to motivate them to be Mo better, you know, be Mo healthier, having Mo love for themselves. Personal training, I mean, not just like sitting there counting their reps. I mean, it's like everything I have in me into them. And I found that the hip hop industry, we do kind of gravitate towards one another. I don't know, maybe it's just the energy. But one of my clients is from Supreme Soul, who was uh, one of the finalists on America's Best Dance Crew. She makes working out fun, actually, because she kind of gears it in a way where I could do it on my own, and I don't feel like it's like a job. I feel like it's something that I want to do, and keep me. it keeps me pretty inspired to work out every day. Your ability to centipede, I mean, I've never seen anything like it. Like, I'm scared to try. I can never follow up your act. But, okay, so tell me how you discovered this centipede talent, and and... I guess, how do you, how do you do it? I wasn't coordinated with feet and hands, but I could move, you know? It became like one of my trademark things to do, I guess, and um, and I think through the years, the core strength and the upper body strength has allowed me to reach great heights, literally and figuratively, <laughs> as well as distance. That is something I'm, I'm super proud about. In a perfect world, my ultimate goal is um, to be the next Richard Simmons. <laughs> He has such inspirational things that just kind of lift you up and, and that's what I want to be to other people is just to be that, that motivation um, for people who just want to become more better versions of themselves. My name is Marina and you're watching On The Flip Side. celebrating the release of our 2009-2010 Research Girl calendar. I think that my shot uh, turned out the way it is thanks to like a very talented crew who uh, helped make it possible. We shot the calendar in the British Virgin Islands. We're the first team in the NBA to actually shoot our calendar abroad. So it's really exciting to release it. We had beautiful shots. It was probably one of the most amazing places I've ever been to. We did all different various islands throughout the British Virgin Islands, and I was on Tortola. And I actually was able to model the Icky bathing suit, which is a clothing line within this area. And a fabulous, look it up, Icky clothing line. They wouldn't line. let me use that one. <laughs> they wouldn't let me model that one. Um, I actually work for an oil company. I am, yeah, I'm an IT advisor. My background is mathematics and computer science. When I first joined this team, never in my wildest dreams did I ever think I would, one, get to do a calendar in the Virgin Islands, of all places, okay? Um, and to have a celebration like this, Unimaginable. We sell the calendars at every home game at the Verizon Center. We actually have a booth where you can meet us and take pictures with us and have autographs. That's going to do it for this Big Apple edition of On the Flip Side. Thanks for watching and remember, you can always find me on the flip side.